disc brake assembly. This is your rotor. The rotor is what the brake pads grab onto to help stop the vehicle. Rotor brakes are usually better because it allows better cooling. This is your caliper. This is where the brake pads mount. As you can see, here's the brake pads in here. This is what the, pi the piston from the caliper forces the brake pads up against the rotor and uh, it stops the vehicle. This caliper slides, allows the caliper to slide, move, and adjust. Here's your brake line. This part's rubber, so uh, allow for suspension travel and stuff. And, uh, here's the bleeder valve. You open this to let air out on the lines. You typically do this uh, every brake job whenever uh, you're changing the brakes. Here's the emergency brake cable. This runs up to the cab. You, know, you mash a little lever in there and it pushes the brake pads up against the rotor. Uh, this is the squealer tab. Whenever the pads start to wear down, this will make a screeching noise and it helps tell you that you need to change your pads. And that's pretty much it about uh, disc brakes. This truck has all four disc brakes and um, at, like all other vehicles it has a master cylinder. The brake lines go up in the master cylinder and the master cylinder after you hit the brake pedal it has pistons in it and it forces the brake fluid to each wheel over here. So this one's a drum brake. This is your brake shoes. Here's your wheel cylinder. Instead of having a caliper, this is uh, replaces the caliper basically. Uh, there's a piston inside there. Whenever you hit the brakes, it pushes the pads up against the brake drum, which is right here. You have springs in here that pulls the brake pads. That after you hit the after the wheel cylinder spreads them out, the springs help push the pads out and pull them back in. This is your parking brake right here. It, it has a parking brake cable just like the disc brake. Whenever you apply the parking brake, it uh, pushes the pads up against the drum. The drum brakes are, are getting obsolete now. Uh, disc brakes usually pull better than uh, the drum brakes. And uh, like, the, like disc brakes, it goes into a master cylinder and uh, it pushes the shoes against the brake drum.